I know that a lot of producers on the platform, they sometimes, if they're first starting off, they struggle with kind of networking and how to find those people to collab with, how to find those people to teach you, to support you, to to teach you those basic things that that friend did for you. Um, so how did you kind of like network and, and find those people? I mean, did socials just kind of, you know, blow up for you and that helped you find them? Did you go to any like particular sites? Did you just like DM producers? Like what was it that you did or that helped you out specifically? Uh, so what helped me out was more so, more of social media because I use a lot of hashtags. Like I would just dump a whole bunch of hashtags on my posts in general. So that was that was one thing. And another thing, um, well, I do I did follow a lot of producers at the time. So whenever they want to collab, then they'll definitely DM me and be like, "Hey, I'm interested in collabing." So that will be publicity for it. The producer and me at the same time so that will open doors for many more opportunities to collab with other producers and just in general like I'm from Maryland and we have a whole bunch of artists and um, producers that are just up and coming and just are so happy to work with other producers so I definitely have a lot of producer friends here in Maryland I met a whole bunch of other producers in school and um, just word of and also word of mouth pretty much mm -hmm. yeah, yeah for sure. I really I really I always like to ask that question whoever like whatever show we're on whoever is on because I think that having that support system with you having like-minded individuals and kind of being able to push each other in a way and teach each other like you know yeah. having that type of environment around you you may not like if you don't have it yet you may not think that it's as much of as important as it is, but when you are around it, um, it's crazy. And that goes for anything. Like, you know, it, it doesn't even necessarily apply to just producers, whatever profession you're in, you have to surround yourself with people who are like-minded, who are going to be pushing you, who, who, even if you view them as um, like competition in a way, you use that to kind of drive you right so it's like oh how, you know I really like that about this beat how did you do that like teach me let's learn from each other um and that's definitely really important and I think that if you do use all the tools available to you especially you know with so many platforms that we have out right now um there's no way that networking is as hard as you as as starter producers make it in their head right like if anything like if you're in the chat right now like you have the chat to 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 be networking <laughs> with everyone in the chat like yeah. if you have any type of social media like go live like you know even if it's just like you making a beat and you may like mess up people may see like your creative process they may see see you get frustrated like it is what it is, but at the end of the day, when you're being like your raw, your real authentic self, I think that's what kind of resonates with others um, and really gets you those genuine connections, right? Because other people, they may just be hitting you up because they're like, oh, you know, I see you're popping, so let me try to connect with you. Whereas it's like, you know, if I kind of grow with you and I see you from the beginning, it's like, okay, I see you're not, you're not necessarily perfect and we're all kind of going through the same thing and we're growing together. And so I think, I just think that's super important. And I've seen you just use your platform tremendously. So guys, like anyone who has an IG, go follow her right now because I tuned into her lives, like I said, and I was hella entertained and I am definitely not a producer. So 